Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Matsuro and we're here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorial. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content. Just to let you guys know that all of the mods is inside my description below and that includes the requirements too. And just to let you guys know, to disable your antivirus. So with that all said, let's get straight into the video. Welcome back guys and now we are here with a new mod and this mod is called Lamar's Custom Classic Business Mod 1.6 and this mod is created and developed by HKH191 so guys this one this mod is a completely different mod okay this is not Benny's okay so warning it's not Benny's but it's just Lamar's custom classic uh, business and it just like brings more into the mod so I will show you guys okay so before we do get straight into this mod guys okay I always start with a new clean folder so you guys know that it does actually work I already tested this mod and all the missions and they all work so guys all you guys gotta do is download this mod I already done it so I don't need to download it open up your open IV and guys remember I am starting a new folder so as you guys can see there's no mods in here it's just completely with no mods okay so let's just quit out of there open up your open IV then grab the auto V windows Then once you guys have done that, then all you guys got to do is go to Tools, ASI Manager, then install the whole thing. Click Yes, and then Install. Now guys, that's all you guys got to do, and now exit out of your Open IV. Go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, right click and open file location. Once you guys do that, then extract your files guys so we are going to go and start with the script hook v's okay so guys all you got to do now is go to your script hook v open up the extract file drag it towards the side open up your bin bottle and then now select then put h.dll and script hook v.dll and drag it into your GTA V main directory. If this pops up, just push replace. Quit out of that, open up your script hook v.net, wait for a few seconds and drag it towards the side. Then select the whole thing, okay? Script hook v.net.asi.dll and .xml and drag them all into your GTA V main directory. Now the next one is Trainer V. Drag it towards the side and select Trainer V dot ASI and dot INI and drag it into your GTA V main directory. Quit out of that guys and open up your menu extract file. Drag it towards the side and select menu stuff folder and menu dot ASI. Drag it towards your GTA V main directory and then quit out of that. Now guys, this is optional. You can use this if you want to, but open up your map reveal and open interiors. And then now make sure you copy the whole thing. But guys, really important. You must have open interiors, okay? That is really important, okay? Drag it towards your GTA V main directory. And then now guys, all you guys got to do now is right click, refresh, then right click, and then create a new folder and name that folder scripts. Once you guys do that, push enter again. Then now all you guys got to do now next is select Lamar's uh, custom classic business extract file. This 
then now guys all you got to do now is select the folder and copy the LCC custom folder and Lamar's custom classic business .dll. drag them into your scripts folder and then that's it exit out of that guys and then make sure you have the latest native UI .dll file and all you guys got to do, do is drag it towards the side and then install the latest native UI. Now guys, we basically finished with that and all you guys got to do next is right click again, refresh your folder, exit out of, out of your folder, right click and refresh your desktop. And now guys, I will see you guys in the game. And welcome back guys, and we are in the game. So before we do start the mod, we are going to check to see if the mods work. So I press F4, and that works. And press F8 twice, and that works. So guys, like what I said before, that this mod, it's, it's not being easy, okay guys? It's something different, okay? So all you guys gotta do, okay, now, is look at the map, okay? And as you guys can see, that there's three new options here. We've got uh, LCC Tune Shop here. And we've got a Lamar business over here. And we've got the garage over here, the vehicle warehouse. So guys, those are the three um, business that we've got over here. So, so what we're going to do guys, is that we are going to go to the main business. Which is at uh, Simeon's... Um, workshop so we are going to teleport there but before we do just in case if we fall underneath the ground we are going to go and to go and turn on the um mods just in case if we die and turn off the police and lastly go to settings audio no that yep now guys we're gonna go and teleport there and we're gonna go and check out their business. So yeah, this is Lamar's business. Uh, really, technically it is Simeon's, but yeah. But the mod says it's a Lamar. So yeah, so right now, this is why you need the open interiors, guys, so you can actually get in. If you don't install the open interiors, then you might fall down a map, okay? So make sure you install the open interiors. Now guys, all you got to do now, okay, is hover over the red spot and now you got, uh, now, now it says it will cost you $2 million to purchase the business. So I'll buy it and now, then now you will get a message, hey dog, I just heard you bought a new business. This is going to be legit, homie. So, all you guys, all you guys got to do now is go back over it now and you can see that you've got some jobs here to do. You can expand your business if you want to, but I tried it with guys and it does work. You can do a math business too if you want to, it does work. So guys, let's just say, um, let's just say, uh, let's do a quick mission, eh? Uh, special mission, uh, let's just say, uh, this one over here. Now it says here, yeah, retrieve the Tesseract and bring it back to the vehicle warehouse. So guys, we're going to go and retrieve um, our vehicle. So let's go and get their vehicle. And their vehicle is, where is it, right here. So guys, we're going to go and cheat, okay, because that's all, because uh, I don't want to make this video too long. So we're going to go and do a mission right now, guys. And we are going to get our guns out. And do the mission. And there you go, guys. Just take up, take up these guns right here. Hold on, guys. Okay. One more. Make sure that you don't destroy the car. And there you go. And now. We are going to the vehicle warehouse, guys. I'm just going to teleport there. Um, and here's the vehicle warehouse, guys. I'm just showing you guys that the mission does work, okay? 
And now I'm going to fix the and clean the vehicle. There you go. And now we're going to go and take it back. Uh, we got we got to the pickup mice driving out there. Okay, there you go. And now they got the car. And now you have finished the mission, guys. Pretty easy, eh? Well, it is pretty easy if you're teleporting to places and using God might so yeah. And now guys, let's go over here and check out this business. Um, yeah guys, I'm just only showing you guys all these business, okay? Because, so you guys know that it does work. Now guys, with this business, you need a car to actually get here, okay? So go and press F8, vehicle, spawn a vehicle, and I'm just going to spawn, um, what's vehicle shall I spawn? Ah, uh, this one over here. Don't know why I changed that one. Hold on, guys. The audio is a bit too loud. Don't know why. So, guys, um, we are over here now. Now, so it says here, press E to teleport to two shops. So, here we go. And now we are there. The shop engine power. We can change the engine uh, to whatever. Confirm. Purchase. Please confirm first. Oh, wait. And there you go. Now extras, upgrades. Uh, and there you go, guys. Uh, so what does this do? Okay, this custom shop. Okay, it just only customs your car, uh, you know, your engine, and, and all that stuff, guys. So yeah, but you can do that with a mod menu, really. Uh, and yeah, so guys, let's go and do one more quick job, okay? So I can show you guys that it does work. See how fast the car is now. Because um, uh, because um, the reason why the car is fast because you just only um, upgraded the vehicle. That's why. So well, let's get back in, get back in here, guys, and let's do one more business and let's do um, long haul missions. Uh, there you go. Okay, deliver the vehicles to the buyer in Pleader Bay, but be careful of any damage comes out of your final cut. Ooh. Okay. And here goes the vehicles, guys. We've got to deliver these vehicles to Pleader Bay. But, guys, I'm not going to go there, okay? Well, I am, but um, I'm going to teleport there. And we are going to Pleader Bay, and it's around here somewhere, guys. See you, guys. So, we're going to teleport here, guys. And now there we go. Uh, so yeah, so yeah, guys. Um, the reason why it says max stock and annual gain and stock value because um, I tell you that there, what you need to be doing is driving there, and now the longer you take, the longer the money rise up. So I just tell you put it there because I wanted to show you guys that it does work. So guys, like always, you guys saw that I installed the mod in a clean folder. So guys, if it does not work for you, then there is a mod inside your folder that is stopping the mod to work. So guys, if you need any help for any mods, okay, or for this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'm more than welcome to help you guys out. So guys, with that all said, thank you for watching. If you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content or tutorial videos and i'll see you guys in my next video thanks for watching peace and i'm out